Hi and welcome back to my channel. We are now doing part three of my general reading for my very close friend. And I really want to get into the clarification of what is going on here. What I'm seeing is that at the moment something is hidden. Someone's feelings or intentions are still hidden at the moment. And I'm feeling like they will come to light within the next two months because we have here the moon card with the magician card. So it's something that you have been manifesting where maybe you haven't had much clarity around the situation. But the fact that the moon card is not in reverse is telling me that the moon's light will reveal the person's feelings or intentions. I do feel like the person is a king of pentacles. So Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn person. And then with the six of wands, we see that the person is also a celebrity or a public figure, someone in the public eye. And we see that this whole situation requires patience. This Seven of Pentacles does not want to leave me alone today. Like, really. Alright, let us see what else comes up. So, to clarify the Nine of Swords in reverse. We have Five of Wands. So, normally this card speaks about small arguments. People arguing around you. But since it is not in reverse in this sense, it is telling me again, there's a situation that makes you feel, or is making you feel very overwhelmed. Because you're trying to take all the bits and pieces and put them together to create a whole idea. That is what I'm feeling. So that is what is causing the inner turmoil, the anxiety, I'm feeling like also because you dealt with a person from your past. This is you getting all your emotions out. Getting all your frustrations out. In order to bring you peace. And this whole situation is somehow still at play within the months of November and December. So you can expect the after effects of that to start showing. You and I both know what I'm talking about here. You dealt with a toxic person. You made peace with what the person has done to you or had done to you. And basically you're trying to now put pieces together in order to heal. All right, with the Seven of Cups in reverse, you have Page of Wands. So the pages are messengers, we know that already, but I'm feeling like this page comes with an announcement or news. Now, I don't know if since this comes with the Seven of Cups reversed, I don't know if you will receive some news that will perhaps leave you feeling quite overwhelmed. And I don't know if that is maybe something to do with that toxic individual that you've cut out. Maybe this is him making contact with you. Or there is some kind of an announcement or news coming in. That will leave you feeling a little bit overwhelmed. And you will then need to prioritize or make a choice. Or think what is more important. With the Two of Cups reversed, that love connection... Death. There is the death card right there. So there is a transformation happening right now. This person is not in your life in a romantic sense. That is about to change with the death card. Because death is about transformation. We have two Scorpio cards here. Death and judgment. So you could be dealing with a Scorpio individual too. Someone who is perhaps a mediator someone helping you in some way in your life but if not then it's talking about a rebirth a renewal a change all right a change 
basically these two cards together are telling me there will be a change with regards to your love life so where you're single now you might not be single by the end of the year that's good news ten of pentacles reversed the sun reversed all right so I'm seeing that I'm gonna put these two cards aside because it's something to do with maybe a domestic situation or something with a family situation and I'm feeling like it's connected to that devil individual in your life I'm feeling like this person really hurt you and stole your happiness away from you with this son there's a child featured on that card so this is talking about your your toxic family member the person who really let you down in your childhood and stole your happiness from you stole your childhood from you but there's a message that somehow within the next two months this story is coming in again meaning that it's something that you will have to deal with I mean you've dealt with it internally already but I'm feeling like you can expect some communication from this person perhaps and these two cards are basically just talking about that it's talking about a domestic situation and closure coming in for you within these next two months well it is amazing to me how the cards can tell a story so directly it is just amazing All right the seven of, of ones reversed king of cups wow look at that the person who has been resisting something is the king of cups obviously he won't show up as the king of pentacles because we have king of pentacles already but this is not talking about his identity it is rather talking about his personality okay so someone who's very sensitive very creative and artistic that person has been resisting feelings and they will no longer be able to resist it they are slowly coming to terms with their feelings and coming to accept their feelings let's see the knight of wands all right eight of pentacles reversed so someone is gathering the courage to actually come forward someone is working on themselves and working on something working towards a goal to come forward and come in with an announcement or a message because this person is very meticulous that eight of pentacles energy is someone who's very specific someone who's working very timelessly I'm smiling because you need to have patience this person is working very meticulously very slowly towards coming forward they are slowly gathering their courage to actually reveal themselves and step forward with a message Okay, with the tower you have ten of wands reversed which is the energy I could feel earlier when the five of wands showed up I saw ten of wands in my mind I actually had to like do a double take and think is this really five because in my mind I saw ten so this person is definitely mustering up the courage they're getting their life together they actually want to now come forward and reveal themselves and they know that it will cause a tower moment actually even more so for themselves rather than for you because this person knows that it's kind of like if I come forward and reveal my feelings gosh I'm gonna end up really shocking myself this person is already feeling like they they've really surprised themselves with their feelings because it's something that they did not even expect they did not even expect to fall for you that is what I'm hearing right the hermit reversed with the devil with the four of swords I'm taking those cards 
together and I want clarity on those three cards together flip look at this just look page of cups reversed ace of cups I am getting goosebumps like from head to toe right now so after this I'm gonna stop um, I'm gonna stop right here after this last message and continue in part four because this is such an important message right now this is telling me with the hermit reversed with the devil with the four of swords reversed it is telling me that basically that has been the blockage all along that toxic individual that you are now slowly starting to forgive you healing from your past hurt from what this person did to you and you're slowly starting to accept, come to terms with it. That has been the blockage all along. Because along with that ex acceptance and forgiveness comes new love. You're done with the childishness. You're done with people from your past. If someone from your past comes in with an apology, by the way, you might even get an apology with the Page of Cups. But don't take it too seriously because it might not be very sincere. But wow, I feel like I can just get tears in my eyes right now. Because I'm feeling like this person from your past is perhaps the one wanting to come in and sort of make amends. I'm saying sort of because it won't be in the way you want him to make amends. But you will just accept it. I feel like you will accept it to an extent simply because it's part of your healing process i feel like that has been the blockage all along the minute you let go and deal with this person new love comes in for you i'm speechless like i have no words i literally have no words all right stay tuned for part four we'll just finish up here and get some last messages